On Friday the 16th of March, the De Montfort Students' Union held an election results show in which new full and part-time representatives were appointed. However, no sooner had the results been announced, tweets using the NotMyDSU hashtag began circulating, claiming malpractice and cheating in the elections by four of the full-time officials. A protest followed on Monday the 19th of March. So uh, we are currently holding a protest at the DSU um, because of recent allegations towards certain candidates. Um, there has been a lot of complaints with regards of um, allegations of cheating. Um, there is currently an investigation underway and the student body has currently circled a petition um, for a referendum to be called for a re-election. Um, and we're just here at the DSU today to try and raise some awareness for that um, and get some more students on board um, to make sure that the elections are run in a free and fair way in the future and that RSU is uh, represented of all the students' opinions and votes. Um, yeah, I guess as a candidate, um, it's been incredibly frustrating having um, given lots of various pieces of evidence to um, the, the DSU um, and I kind of feel like they've not been acting on appropriately um, and I guess calling for a referendum is probably the only way that we are actually going to be able to get our voices heard. Having spoken to some of the protesters, occupying the SU offices and typing up statements, we also got the chance to speak with the protesters outside. Braving the cold today, uh, seeing a solidarity not only with fellow candidates that I might have been against or might have been working with over the uh, last week, but with just random students that are just passionate about DSU is absolutely fantastic to see. When do we want it? We are protesting today because uh, when do we want it? candidates have been found when cheating. There's evidence of this on camera, and when plenty of uh, people have sent in. Uh, you know, uh, evidence of that happening. But the reason that we are protesting is because we want a re-election that's fair and just, not one that's full of dishonesty and cheating. Not my DSU. Not my DSU. Not my DSU. Re-election. So we're here um, supporting democracy, supporting the integrity of the elections and demanding re-elections following allegations of cheating, concerns of breaking election rules um, and many, many of the full-time roles being actually elected by the alleged cheaters and rule breakers. So we want to protest. We want something to change and we won't leave until we do. I was almost a victim of the cheating as was my friends and I, fe like, I felt like because we're both, we're both vulnerable students like luckily I'd already voted and for, it was close to the lecture for me and my friend anyway so we managed to escape it but I feel like I, that this shouldn't be going on like vulnerable students should not feel pressured to vote. We also caught up with the four full-time officials in question, as well as another person who worked on their campaign. The last few, uh, last two days, uh, we can see that there are a lot of uh, tweets against us. I don't know why it's happening because we uh, we hadn't done any allegations or any, you know. Uh, I think uh, you know, DMV students are necessary. Kids. We can't, you know, uh, force to get votes. We work hard for the four days. So it's not uh, right, I think, because um, they can protest, they can com give complaint, everything. That's okay. Uh, you know, it's a uh, it's a democratic. Yeah. Now, now they are calling us a liar. How we can liar to you know every you know 1,900 four students? Day, yeah, four day we did a uh, oh. from 8 a.m. to so 11 p.m. Yeah. So um, you know, all we have to say is we work hard, we work together. We campaign together, we introduce ourselves together and we, we ask for, for people to get vote. All the DSU and all the all the everyone said to get vote is the way to get vote is to talk people, to talk students. That we all did. So now we are waiting for the investigation results. Yeah, we are very happy to welcome that because we don't have any problem with that. Uh, I think uh, I think my supporters, my you know, my voters will support me every time. It's about letting the investigation run through, run its course, and then basing any accusations 
um, and the forthcoming decisions on evidence. Aside from the actual allegations, there's been a lot of uh, smearing, a lot of discrimination, um, and in, in extreme cases, racism. And it's their hard work and the belief in the democratic process that got them this win. That's my firm belief. Um, and yeah, we welcome the evidence to come through at the end of the investigation. There are any students that have felt victim to harassment during the election process. Um, I strongly uh, urge them um, to refer to the DSU statement um, and send any evidence or um, testimonials um, to the DSU comms at dmu.ac.uk because um, we kind of need as much evidence to prove uh, these allegations.